Namaskar, very good morning. My dear students, you are busy with the examination since long due to this pandemic COVID-19 situation, but it is not under my control and the problem face throughout the world. Dear students, there are some queries, there are some problems raised by some students and they require some clarification for the online examination. That's why I want to give some clarification of some queries raised by some students. One query about the logout. If you will log out, don't worry. You can again log in and you continue your exam. Earlier answers given will be saved and for the remaining answers you have to continue. Whenever you are writing and any question is difficult, you can skip that question and you continue with the next question and later on you further go to the earlier question. So the time within time limit you have to finish it. So total time will be the same. If the patients 70 then the 70 minute is there. If the patients are 80, 80 minutes are there. Whenever you log out but and you again log in but you will not get an extra time. The time will be same means the 70 minutes. So as in when you will be logging, you will get total 70 minutes to complete your examination. The speed is not the problem. Any 3G, 4G shell have the, uh, you will get this speed given by the university. So speed is not the problem. If any problem of the net at your house, you select any appropriate place at your village or the Gram Panchayat where you will get the net properly or otherwise you will go to your college and you will get the Wi-Fi facility. There will be a pre-test before examination. This pre-test is required and it is mandatory for all students those who are option given for the online examination because this pre-test will make assurance for the success of the examination and you will not and you will be familiar with the question uh, and the online examination system so on the day of examination you will not face any exam uh, any problems another is the there is a call forwarding facility suppose you are using this uh, shell for examination then you are getting the call and it will disturb you so better to use the call forwarding facility before appearing for the examination so you can forward your call uh, to your family members or the friends so you will not be disturbed by the external phones received uh, during the examination my dear students don't worry you just believe in the official circular of the GTE there may be a number of other videos they are describing by the different way but always verify the website of GTU and refer the GTU circular on the website that is the only authentic source for you. All the best. Thank you. Thank you very much.